Hey guys, RC Outdoors here, and uh, as you can tell, this is the ECX drone run. This is going to be stage two of the upgrade series. So, so far, I've gotten my Proline Trencher X tires in. As you can see, those are pretty good looking. The, uh, the paint that I put on them didn't come out that well. I'm trying to get it off. I may actually just get new tires. Um, the tires kind of went to crap. The idea of those went to crap. Um, I've installed the lights on the front and the lights on the back bumper. I had lights in them, um, but one of my friends kind of ripped them out. I got them off of a wraith and they wanted them back. So while I was sleeping, they ripped them back out. So I got to get a new light kit. So of course, same body and everything. Uh, as you can see, I've been bashing it crap up. Last time I mentioned that I had a weird Jimmy rigged uh, bumper on here. I just went away with that. I just glued the one that I broke back together, installed the light buckets on this bumper. Um, the shocks that I had were these shocks. I took these off because I got a new truck and I thought these would fit and they didn't and I just haven't gotten around to putting them back in. I was also talking about my motor. I was planning on putting an Axial 27 turn motor in and I did do that. Um, I was just getting ready to do a video and I just I wasn't really impressed by that motor's performance so I just went ahead got a, another HPI Firebolt 15 turn and put it in here um, but yesterday I tried to run it and it was not running right um, I do apologize to Ken's life he really wants a running video and I'm trying to do my best um, I hate to keep my viewers waiting on videos um, and then about two months ago I posted an update video and new uh, new series which was the ETX Runner and I wanted to do the uh, I wanted to upload every Saturday and every Wednesday unfortunately I had a job opportunity which I took um, to make some extra money and since I did that I got a bunch of new vehicles so expect a lot of new videos um, so that's why I didn't upload every Saturday and every Wednesday for the past week or for the past two months but I'm gonna be doing my best to at least upload once a week um, if I don't get to it I do apologize um, something has come up but getting back to the ECX Ram Runner I put some Axial Wraith Big Bore shocks on here as you can tell this thing could use a little bit of WD-40 so right now my plans for this thing I do not know what my plans are um, I know I do want to get a light bar to put in here about a two incher so it can look like the um, ECX Runner a kitty it's okay but um, I am still planning on putting the lights in here, getting another light control board, installing it. As you can see, I had it super glued right here because my double stick tape was not holding. Um, but I have that coming. Well, I have a video coming up for that, hopefully. And then I'll be installing the light bar, installing the lights back into these front ones, installing the lights back into these rear ones, and, of course, getting the light bar. Um, I gotta open up the diff and the transmission. There's a lot of binding in there. Um, this thing's just been causing me a lot of trouble lately. Um, so I gotta do a lot of work on this. It'll probably last, I'd say, the next video for this, for the, um, Ram Runner Upgrade Series Video 3. That probably will not be out for at least another month, unfortunately. Um... But do expect a lot of other videos. I have a bunch of new vehicles that I will be doing some videos on. And I will be getting some running videos out before winter hits. Um, winter will probably be hitting here in uh, Colorado probably in the next month or two. So expect videos very soon. Um, as you guys have seen or need to see, I have the... Um, I have a new charger, and it is the Venom Pro Quad. I have the uh, 
the uh, unboxing video and I have the um, tutorial on how to use this video. Oops. I do have the uh, tutorial on how to use this uh, charger up on my channel. So I'm going to keep you guys entertained no matter what. Um, but that's about it on this truck so far. Um, I am still planning on putting a brushless system in here and getting away with all this dumb brushed stuff. Um, but it's just been really hard lately to pop out some videos, but I'm going to be getting back into it. I'm going to do my best and I, I do it for you guys. So I don't have really any, any excuses to uh, not doing stuff but I'm gonna be getting some more videos out here expect them soon but uh, remember to uh, like comment subscribe leave um, any questions anything down in the comments you want to ask anything RC related leave it down in the comments or anything about my pit ask it down in the comments if you guys want a product review down in the comments just Anything you guys want, leave it down in the comments and I'll get back to you or get the video done as soon as possible. So remember guys, to like, comment, subscribe, of course. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.